What I hope that people get from it, the laymen get from it, is that martial arts is different from football, different from soccer, different from baseball. It's not just a sport, it's actually a lifestyle. It's something that we, that I've done for over 28 years and that I want to continue to do. Um, it's not something that you can just pick up and, and throw away, you know, that it can really change your life. When I was 12 was the first time I saw my first martial art movie, and that's what inspired me to um, do martial arts in the first place. <laughs> the movie was called The Soul Bro Brothers of Kung Fu, <laughs> with Carl Scott and Bruce Lai in it, you know? But it touched me, you know, to the point where I was in the backyard kicking and punching with my, like any young boy does, my imaginary enemies, you know, and with my nunchucks and, but I always knew that I wanted to do Kung Fu. Well, the particular style of matches that we do, Seven Star Praying Matches Kung Fu, um, it's very direct, uh, at least the way that Sifu Lee teaches it. It's very direct and it's to the point, and you can use it for self-defense. It's very intricate. Uh, we do have the circular movements, and you know, in the beginning, the big movements, but, you know, as you become more proficient in the system, those circles become smaller, and, um, the more, the more you practice, the secrets become unlocked because obviously with experience and time and having the right instructors, um, it's good for self-defense. It's good, it's just straight, direct to the point, And that's what I like. All the flowery movements, I get it. I, you know, I understand the, the, the concept, the principle behind it, but I like things that are direct and straight to the point. And I think Mantis does that. Kung Fu has been that one thing that I've had that, and learned and practiced that no one could ever take away from you. You know, it, it, once you learn it, it becomes yours.